Rediscovering Old Frontiers. This is a brief four minute presentation on the oversight property in Washington State. This is the Cook Mountain Mining District. It contains the Lamefoot, Key West, Key East, and Overlook deposits, all of which were mined and processed at a central mill called the Kettle River Mill. The Kettle River Mill is still operational. It's currently processing ore from the Buckhorn Mine. Now the Yellow Polygon is the oversight project. It's five kilometers from the mill, and it is fully accessible by haul roads that were used to access Key East and Key West. Adamera has developed a very simple exploration model that relates the oversight property to the adjacent Overlook Gold Deposit. In this model, it contemplates a limestone horizon with mineralization at its base that's been folded, providing multiple mineralized horizons, and more importantly, an opportunity for the Overlook Deposit to project under the oversight property. Now, first of all, at Overlook, we see mineralization on top of the limestone unit. In this case, this is considered to be an overturned stratigraphic sequence. Here, essentially, the geology is upside down. At Oversight, less than 500 meters from the Overlook Gold Deposit, Adamera intersected nearly 7 meters of gold-bearing massive magnetite with sulfite at the base of the limestone. Now this is suggesting that the stratigraphy is upright. It is not upside down as you would have seen at Overlook. Furthermore, Drilling that was done historically was targeting mineralization at the top of the limestone, much like what you would have seen at Overlook. When, in, when mineralization was not observed at the top of this limestone, drilling was terminated before penetrating through the base of the limestone into the magnetite sulfide zone that we intersected in 2014. Let's just do a little recap here. Overlook is 500 meters from where we drilled an oversight. And topographically, there's a 100 meter drop from Oversight to Overlook. Further, we know the geology at Oversight is upright, and at Overlook, it is overturned. Now, the only way you can get that is by folding it. Back to our very simple fold model, we see the geological positions of Overlook and Oversight. Add faulting and erosion to reflect the area. And now you start to see a very significant exploration opportunity here at Oversight. Here you see the deep drilling at Overlook, very shallow drilling at Oversight, but you see a very big gap between Oversight and Overlook and you can see that there's absolutely no deeper drilling at Oversight to test for that lower Overlook limb that could come under the Oversight property. Next at Oversight, we'd like to put in four to five holes in the order of 200 to 300 meters depth. What we want to test with these holes is first of all the upper limb to see if it is mineralized. Secondly, find any fold closures that may be highly mineralized. And third, test for that lower overlook limb that we believe is coming under the oversight property. Oversight is a great opportunity for Adamera. First of all, it's in a mining district and it's right next to the Overlook deposit. It's within five kilometers of an operating mill and there are existing haul roads that run from that mill to the property. What that means is if we are successful in developing a resource on the Oversight property, we do not have to permit and build a mill. We do not have to permit and build roads. We simply have to permit and build an underground mining operation and I think that is a real advantage. So this is Oversight, thank you very much 